Hey guys, it's Steve. I'm the broker at Savvy Realty here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And right now I am in a studio unit, one of the best studio units actually on the market uh, because of the view, and I'll show you that in just a second, but it is also amazing because the price is so low. Studio unit in Revere Towers, which is in the center of Las Vegas Boulevard. You walk out your front door, you are in the middle of Las Vegas, $339,000. Your HOA is about $679 a month but let's get into this unit here. Um, with that price, you do get the furniture, which is one bed and two pieces of art. <laughs> but let's get into the actual unit and let me show you the view here in a second. But let's start for the front door, all right? So I'm walking over to the front door. This is your entrance into the unit. So immediately when you walk in, you have your restroom off to the right. And then we have our cabinetry, going off to the left and we walk right into the unit itself because it's a studio. So we don't have any extra rooms. This is what it is going to be. And we're at about 540 square feet on this unit. And the kitchen area is not smaller than any of the other units that are out there. Um, any, cause it's a studio they didn't, you know, make you a smaller kitchen. It's not a kitchenette. It's a full fledged kitchen, just like all of the other one bedrooms and two bedrooms that are in the community. They do all Bosch appliances for all of the, all of the standard uh, equipment that was here and all Bosch over here with a stainless steel stack, microwave, fridge, uh, oven and dishwasher all here and I do oh look at they did put a they did put a nest in this one that's kind of nice uh, now I want to show you that this is the view so right when you wake up or right when you walk in you would be coming in to this unit in Veer Las Vegas and you would have the fountains from the entrance into uh, Aria an entrance into city center so if I look up I will actually have the whole Aria Casino directly in front of me. And on New Year's, they do have massive fireworks show. So that would be really cool to see, I guess, if you're on vacation. Uh, one thing to note is that they do have this tram that is right in front of the unit. So it's directly in front. Um, I get a lot of customers say, is that tram noisy? Is it loud? And it's absolutely whisper silent. So you, here, whoa, here, it's passing right now. Can you hear anything? Super quiet. Cool, right on, that was perfect. That, that was perfect timing. <laughs> All right, so getting into the actual unit a little bit more, uh, you do have the light color palette or the medium color palette, I'm sorry, with this unit. Um, with Veer, you have the option of having three color palettes. You have a light, a medium, which this is, and a dark. Uh, so this one actually um, fits this unit pretty nice. I do like it. Uh, you do have the blackout and the solar shades blinds in this unit for all of the windows here. So if you want to make sure it's blacked out, we can do that. And of course, you can see it right there. They do have the two blinds set up there. Uh, it looks like this is, oh, it looks like this may be a pullout couch too, potentially. Uh, and that would definitely come with the unit with this one. And you do have a what looks like a queen size bed. Usually how this is set up is we have the bed over on that wall. And then we would have a more a larger area for the couch and the television, which would go right up here as well. Um, so they decided to do it a little bit different, um, you know, to each his own <laughs> with that one. And then let's get into the actual, uh, all the cabinet space and see what, if this unit could be interesting for you or not. Uh, this is a Bosch, uh, Bosch uh, washer and dryer here. And then we open up into this cabinet area over here. And you do have a bar. That is going to be all of your ethernet cords that are right behind there. There we go. I'll close this one up. And then we'll get into this next one right here. Oh, and your power supply is there as well as more storage area for anything that you need in this part. You could probably put some really cool custom racks in there. That'd be kind of neat. Uh, it looks like they put, uh, oh, is this one of those shoe things? Yes, oh my gosh, so cool. Uh, you can put your shoes, I put mine by the door, <laughs> but you can put your shoes right in here. That's neat. 
you know, that's a good use of space. I haven't had anybody else in these uh, apartments do that or condos, sorry. <laughs> so you do have a single vanity. You do have a lot of space under here for storing items. These drawers do pull out. So you'd be able to whoop right there. And let's look at the one down below. Here we go. And then you do have this vanity that is going to be, I think we call this a vessel. I always call it a vessel sink, but I like that it comes out and above. So you are not bending over too much for being able to wash your hands. It doesn't feel small, it feels really good. And I am not a tall person, so it is just fine. <laughs> but if I was a tall, I mean, that would be a bummer having really small sink, right? And again, like and subscribe if you wanna see more content about high rise condos in Las Vegas. Thank you. Uh, the mirror here does have two layers. So you have the main mirror there, and then you have this second area that actually has light coming off of it and it is hanging from the ceiling, which I think is really cool feature that was, um, it's not custom, it's standard for these units. And that kind of goes to show the high end build that Veer has. So this is gonna be your walk-in shower area. Here we go. And then I know that a lot of these units actually, some of the, like the one bedrooms, two bedrooms, they'll have actually a bench here. They did do just this nook area here, which is kind of nice because I know my wife would say, I want to put my foot up and actually have to be able to shave like this. So that is probably a benefit that some person engineered it that way. <laughs> and then you do have these shelves over on this side and the taller area down below. And then, of course, this comes with a Louis Vuitton Paris uh, towel. <laughs> and then this is your door going into the bathroom. I do like these doors. They're pretty cool and modern. And you know what the touches that they have? Like the ambient lighting that's from above over here. I really like that in here. I think that's kind of neat. And then oh, I want to open this for you too, just so you can see inside. Your air handler is in your unit. Do, 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 do. and your air filters are all available downstairs. You can purchase it right there. No need to head to Home Depot. And then just for the kitchen area, I wanna make sure that I open up some of these for you so you can see inside and see what kind of storage you're working with over here. Here we go. And let's go down below and show these massive, massive storage area underneath here. You can fit all your pots and pans in here. And again, this is a full kitchen area. It is not smaller because it is a studio. And oh, look at that. You even have a little uh, storage area over here, which you can make use for. Being in small spaces, uh, you know that you have to make every inch count, right? Um, now, again, oh, look at it. The tram's coming by again. You can't even hear it. That's pretty good. But again, like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. We'll see you guys and have a good one. Hope to see you in high-rise in Las Vegas someday. Talk to you.